the wet wedding was my action sequence. It's my fight at the end of the Avengers. <laughs> it's the closest I get. Well, you're in the wet wave. It's meant to be the wedding weather from hell during the wedding from heaven. So they were just blasting us in the face with water and wind. And it was funny because it makes you a group. You know, you really band together. But also no one wants to stand at the front because <laughs> that's where you get the brunt of it and stuff. And um, it was a lot of fun, but it was really, really wet. You know, we didn't say to anybody, look horrified and be horrified, because they were horrified being placed under these tons of water. We obviously got totally drenched when we come out of the wedding. It adds to the comedy, really, this gale force winds building, and then we had to make our way all the way up this cliff top right to the house, where there's a marquee waiting for us at the party. So tottering down this cliff in gale force winds with, you know, these fire engine hoses being sprayed right in your face was quite hard to, to deal with, but you didn't have to act, so it was fine. It was our action sequence, so we did work harder on it than we worked on most things, and particularly on huge things like the tent flying away. It took a lot of testing, and we had to make models of it, and the special effects company, and Mark Holt, he did numerous tests of it, where it tried out various sections of the tent in London. I think they spent most of their money making that tent fly away. I think that was where a lot of the budget went, because they didn't spend it on the time travel effects, so they just said for our big kind of uh, sequence. Always react realistically to what happens to you. So if you don't get hit by a particular splash of water, don't pretend that you have been. They just put a big load of water in the middle of the top of it, like sagging, and then opened it and um, <laughs> on top of a group of people. And I didn't get that, and neither did Rachel. We were really lucky, but uh, Vanessa got it really badly. We had quite a lot of fun with the big split. Everybody just laughed and laughed so much, and then they all run into the house absolutely dripping. And so it becomes just a really good bonding event to then do the speeches and the rest of the wedding. So it was, it was rather marvellous, actually. The truth of the matter is that if you blow a hell of a lot of wind at people, and if you pour a lot of water on them, they will tend to scream and laugh and cover their shirts if they become see-through. So just the actors live with the real high possibility of pneumonia and terminal cold for a couple of days. And what happened in the movie happened to them, poor things. They were they had to go along a windy path and nearly die of, uh, of rain and tornado. Thank you for all staying in character and remembering everything. That went wonderfully better than we could have expected.